Steve had just gotten his driving permit. So I had a talk with his father, and he said to his dad, could he use the family car to go out on a date? His father thought a minute, and then he said to him, Steve, I'll make a deal with you. You bring your grades up, you study your Bible more than you are, and you get your hair cut, and then we'll talk about you driving my car. About a month later, Steve again asked his father if they could discuss his using the family car. They again had a conversation. And the father said, Steve, I'm really proud of you. You brought your grades up. I've seen you study and read your Bible more frequently. But you did not get your hair cut. Steve said, you know, Dad, I've been thinking about that a lot. In the Bible, Samson had long hair. Moses had long hair. Noah had long hair. Even Jesus had long hair. His father said, Steve, you're absolutely right. And you know something else? They walked everywhere they went. Being a father is a constant challenge. This Sunday, June 20th, is Father's Day. So happy Father's Day to everyone entitled to this acclamation. And happy Father's Day to all of you who have played the part of a mentor or big brother to someone. Father's Day is an interesting holiday. We're told businesses make more money on Mother's Day gifts than on Father's Day gifts. More cards are mailed on Mother's Day than Father's Day. Father's Day is a special day, a day that honors a father's commitment and dedication to his family. Being a father can certainly be a challenge. Being a father also provides many, many special blessings.